Paralympic athlete Sarah Hunter is challenging some of the most common disability stereotypes. Paralympics is not the paralyzed games. The Paralympics is the parallel Olympics. It's parallel to the Olympics. It's, it doesn't mean para as in paralyzed. It means parallel. And that's something people don't always know. So we're, it was created with the idea of being equals. She's known as the hunter. In an effort to raise awareness for the Canadian Paralympic movement, the committee is highlighting the fierce determination of 22 super athletes. Sarah Hunter, Paralympic wheelchair tennis, one of the super athletes. Mark Grunheide is a program manager at the BC Centre for Ability. When we have something like the Paralympics to look at as, a, as an example of what persons with disabilities can do, certainly it doesn't mean that everybody who has a disability is capable of these great feats, but it does mean that you know, this segment of the population is as able to perform in competitive sport as any other. We want to be seen as humans first, athletes first, and, and the chair is secondary. It's a part of our equipment. There are, are multiple sacrifices we make so that we can represent Canada to the absolute best of our ability and to hopefully bring home that medal that everyone wants. Two-time Paralympic champion Hunter is gearing up for this summer's London Games. Which are expected to be the biggest Paralympics yet. Francesca Fionda in Vancouver for BCIT Magazine.